Alright guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started. So we are gonna prime our face. So the primer that I'm gonna be using is the Spotlight Illuminating Primer. This has age defining active and everyone loves that. I surely do. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with that. So we're gonna go in and thon in. I have this all over my hands and I don't even have wipes. So give me a second. So the eyebrows, the eye pencil that I'm going to be using is this Maybelline Total Temptation. Um, this one's in that color deep brown. And so in the picture, it looks like she re she has really, really dark, really defined, thick brows. Oh my god, why am I legit dropping everything? That's like super freaking annoying. I'm just going to use this bully to brush out my brows we go I'm tempted to do <laughs> thick brows so I'm gonna go ahead and um Conceal them. I'm going to shape them up just a bit. I'm going to clean them up. So I'm going to be using the LA Colors Conceal Correct. And I'm just going to be taking a flat brush like so to shape them out. So I'm just going to apply the concealer onto the brush. Just at the tip. So that I can blend that out onto my eyebrows. So the foundation I'm going to be using today is my Tarte Hydrating Fo um, Shape Tape Foundation. This one is in light medium honey. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and apply my foundation. So I'm just going to be donning this or swiping this or applying this all over my face. The concealer I'm going to be using is my Smashbox um, Studio Skin 24 Hour Waterproof Concealer, and this is in the color light. Okay, so I'm going to be using my um, AUA Studio Perfect Setting Powder. This is from Shop Miss A. Okay, so I've already primed my lids with a concealer. So I used the same LA Colors concealer and I just um, applied it all over my lid. And I just set it with this color right here. The, I'm using the Sonia Kashuk um, Eye Neutral Palette. Um, and this one's in the number two, so it's just all mattes. And I just, um, what's it called? I just set it with this um, color right here. I'm going to go ahead and go in with this color and use it as my transition shade. So I'm just going to be using a really fluffy brush and just getting that product. And then topping it off and then just applying it ooh, to my crease. This is going to be working as my transition shade.
I'm going to be taking the color underneath the eye. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to be going in with this um, elf blending brush and I'm just going to be applying this chestnut brown right here and just applying that to my brush, tapping off any excess, and then uh, just going to be applying that on the outer V. And then just taking it in halfway into the crease. And then taking it under, of course. So then I'm going to be taking a flat shader brush <coughs> and just applying this white color in underneath our brow. Just going to work as our brow highlight. So I'm just going to take that right underneath. So I'm going to be taking this color right here. Um, it doesn't even say what it is, but this one, this, was, this palette is called the Black Tie Attire. And I'm just going to be taking this rose gold and just applying that all over the lid. And I'm also going to be taking this purple right here as well and just applying that right on top of the gold that we just put. So we're just going to we're just going to create kind of like a wing line and then just smoke that out. So I'm going to be using my L'Oreal Extra Intense Liquid Pencil Eyeliner in black so it comes with a little um, thing right here where you can smoke it out so I'm just going to apply this onto my lid we are gonna just smoke that right out All right, now that I've smoked out both of my eyes, this is how the makeup look is looking so far. Um, this eye looks like it's only eyeliner because my eyes are just so small and chinky and I freaking hate it. And so now I'm gonna be taking actually black, not black, but brown eyeliner. I don't know how I just got black liner all over my leg, but I did. I don't know where the freak that came from. Okay, so I'm gonna be taking brown eyeliner and just taking this underneath the eyes. I feel like using brown eyeliner really makes the brown in my eyes just pop even more. So that's what I'm gonna be using. And so now I'm just gonna be curling my lashes and applying uh, mascara and then from there I'm gonna attempt to put on fake eyelashes um, the ones that I'm gonna be using are going to be using the rose ones All right, so I'm going to attempt to put on lashes off camera because I'm terrible at putting on lashes. So I'm gonna attempt to do that and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so finally, after like 50 million years, I finally put on my lashes. I get started with our blush and bronzer. CoverGirl bronzer, this one is called Golden Tan. Just looks like that. I'm gonna be using my e.l.f. Ultimate Blending Brush. You
uh, Naughty Nude as my blush for today. I'm gonna be using my angled blush brush. Um, this one's from Marshalls. I don't know what brand it is, it doesn't say what it is. And then now I'm going to apply um, highlight. All right, so the highlight I'm gonna be using is my Sonia Kajic and Persian Sunset. I'm just gonna apply this on the tops of my cheeks. And then with my finger, I'm just gonna blend that right in. I'm just gonna put some on my nose. I'm gonna um, line my lip, lip, my lip, right now, and I'm gonna be using the NYX Suede Matte, Matte Lip Liner. I'm just gonna be going in with my Stormy. Sahara Maybelline lipstick and I'm just gonna apply that all over my lips. And then so this is the final look. Why don't you dead yet? Why you so breathing? 